Wide at 560WIND.com. Now, Michael Medved. And now, America's number one show on pop culture and politics. This is the Michael Medved Show. Another great day in this greatest nation on God's green earth. And in this great nation, great confusion continues to infect the public regarding the most controversial war in American history. Not the current war in Iraq, but the war in Vietnam. And debates about that war and misunderstandings about that war sometimes overwhelm our ability to even cope realistically with current issues. It is a great day in fact to try to sweep away the three big lies about the Vietnam War, which is the subject of this special broadcast. We've already talked a little bit about the first two lies. Now, the first two lies involve number one, policy makers who drove us into war, and number two, the soldiers who fought that war. First of all, the lie about the policy makers that this was an unconstitutional war that reflected American imperialism, a desire for world dominance, is not true. It was a war that reflected a consensus among Republicans, among Democrats, about the need to resist communist aggression, and it was not an unconstitutional conflict. Then there's line two. This says that the soldiers who fought the war lost that war on the battlefield and in the process committed horrendous atrocities. That's not only a lie, it's a slander, not even close to the truth. The third lie doesn't have to do with policymakers or soldiers. It has to do with the protesters who stayed home, for the most part, and objected to the war, engaged in defense. And according to the common view that you hear again and again and again from leftists in the press, leftists in the academy, from leftist historians, is that America had stumbled into this horrendous war, and finally, after the casualties became known, and it became clear that America couldn't win, and that we were fighting an unjust and an immoral war, protesters stood up in America dissented from public policy, roused the conscience of the nation, and were able...